my life my rules my style my attitude you love me or hate me i don't care but don't play with me Okay, I don't know what I just watched, but why does this dude look like the Easter Island? And then why does he start just dry humping this girl? <laughs> and and why, why when she punches him, does she explode? <laughs> what? What is this? A lot of you probably wonder what I look like or what I'm thinking when I see a clip like this. But the thing is, I can see through what this was meant to be and I can see the cringe. Maybe this will help you understand what that looks like. Harry? Harry? Harry Potter! No, 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 get your hands off me! <laughs> Harry, no, no, how could you? What's wrong with everyone? Yep, yeah, without a doubt, no questions asked. We're gonna have to blur out that last part. All I can say is, am I surprised? No. Am I disappointed? Yes. I'm very disappointed. I mean, I want to be able to say that kids can have technology at a young age, but if they're making stuff like this, then absolutely no way in spaghetti are they going to be using an iPad if I was a parent and I found out they were doing stuff like this. This girl at my school found out I was non-binary and sent me multiple of these trying to invalidate me. Okay, so let's see what we've got here. We've got, you know, me as in her, superior female pretty and fertile, and then true girls. Let's see what they have to say. Female born non-binary people like you disgust me. You had been gifted such a beautiful gift. Shut up. Who honestly cares what anyone does in their own time or their own private life? It's up to them. The superior female says, and instead of cherishing it and liking girls so we can get rid of the, the world of males. <laughs> I'm confused, who does she not like? Does she not like non-binary people or males? <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm gonna go buy a first class ticket to the sun. You won't have to worry about me. Pretty and Fertile says, throw it away and act masculine and say you're not a girl and notable feminine. You are a waste too. What? The true girl says, society and I hope you realize you being nub and ace is not what was intended for you. You are and will be a fertile. Did... What happened to my brain? I am just so confused of what I actually just read. Do they not like men? Or are they like lesbian? What... What is even going on? How to make a gacha villain. Make it a dark skin colour. Oh, okay. Jesus Christ. <laughs> hey, guys, if you're black, you are a villain, apparently. <laughs> that is... That is unbelievable. I don't know if I can even put that in the video. Listening to my recording back, I, I don't know if I should word it like that. Because obviously if you are black, you're not a villain. These kids are just, just total idiots. But I'm just thinking, hmm, could that ever come back and just be used out of context with me? I certainly hope not. I mean, obviously you guys, the loyal gamer virgins, know for a fact that I am not like that. It's all jokes on my channel. Right, welcome back guys to another episode of Gacha Life Cringe, the thing you guys just love the most on my channel and you just love watching me burn my eyes out. You know how all this spaghetti is. Just remember that not everybody in the Gacha community is a weird little kid. There's only the bad side which we're talking about today. If you enjoy the video, be sure to like and subscribe. It really helps me out a lot. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's just get on in with the video. Don't know if repost, and I don't know if it's the right flair. Hmm, let's see what this is. Let's bet $100 I will turn you gay. I have to touch you sexually. Oh, okay. Oh, that's how it works, guys. I don't know. That just makes it sound like it's an infection to be gay. Like, you know, someone touched you, and, and now you're gay. <laughs> but hey, on the positive side, if you're already gay, that's, that's an easy $100. I'm just saying. Your boy coming back again with more spaghetti. Me reading straight couple comics. Okay, seems pretty boring by the looks of it. Me reading lesbian boy love comics. Oh, yeah. Hmm, yes, gay people are only good for one thing, apparently. And that's being inserted into romantic novels. If you make a story and the characters are boring old straight people, well, that's just not very interesting. But if you make them gay... Well, you just hit a gold mine of people who love that type of thing for all the wrong reasons. 
I mean, I can probably put money down that probably no gay person actually cares about, you know, this person's opinion. But at the same time, if I was gay, I don't think I'd want people just like being like, oh my god, that's so cool. You know, it's a pretty normal thing. No one cares. You want cringe? Wario, show you cringe. Someone is marking my territory. That tree is mine. Okay, so this girl's a cat, I think. I'll handle that, babe. Oh, okay, we've got the big bad guy over here. Little big boyfriend gonna go help his kitten, I think. Hey, why are you marking on my girlfriend's territory? <laughs> She's just a weak cat girl. What are you going to do about it? Oh, oh, damn, it's getting hot in here. Don't you dare say that you made her cry. Oh my god, this is so bad. Thanks, babe, I gotta go mark my tree. And then she just proceeds to just go and whiz waz on the tree. <laughs> Those images were so bad, I honestly just want to go and have a bath in just pure salt. I mean, honestly, why, why are kids even making something like that? It is so weird. Long have the days gone where, like, Fantasy was like princesses and kings. Now it's just kids pretending they're cats and they have rival gang members going around peeing on trees. What? Why? Honestly, just get in the bin, go outside and touch some grass. Forgive me, mom found the poop sock. What? Like, what even? What even is this? Why would you make this? It, am, am, I, am I meant to say like jinkies or something when you find it? How do you forget your own kid? Okay, so what, there's like a fire going on? We forgot our kid. Well, there you go, there's the answer, guys. You have a house fire and you just forget your kid. It is what it is. F in chat for the kid. What did I just stumble upon? Epstein-chan, he, him, bisexual, lovability, cool, Omega. Wow, I can literally think of a thousand, if not more people you could do this with than Je Jeffrey Spaghetti Epstein and calling it Epstein Chan. Who are these kids even looking up to even make something like this? What is it with Gacha and bathroom spaghetti? This is clearly a damn mushroom. I mean, yeah, what is it with Gacha kids just having this obsession with people in toilets? Like, this dude, he's literally got a gas cloud going around him and, and what? I can't tell if these girls are like disgusted by it or generally happy that some dude is just <laughs> just in the toilet making a mess. For everyone, I am autism. I'll never have a good life of my fake family with me now. What is this even meant to be? Is this kid saying that he is the embodiment of autism? Like what? Man, these kids really just have absolutely no limits. I found this while browsing on Google. <gasps> what is it? Owned by... <gasps> A vampire. Okay, cool. No, not really. It's not really that cool. It's it's pretty mundane, actually. Can somebody please explain to me, honestly, the difference and why there is such a divide that one minute, like, you know, gacha cringe kids are making stories about them, you know, having to take a wee on a tree, and then the next minute, it's just like, hey, I'm, a, I'm owned by a vampire. Like, <laughs> why? Right, that's it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Gacha cringe. I don't know how long it's gonna last on my channel for now. I'm just getting... A little bit bored of doing it. With that being said, I do hope you enjoy the video and I hope you all have a fantastic day. I will see you all next time.